imminent kickoff at Hampden Park against Ireland, but the visitors soon take control and move away on the attack. This is the Diamond Jubilee International match between the two countries, so we can expect real fireworks. Of the 59 games played, Scotland have won 46. In a Scots counter-attack, inside left Fernie has it, but over now to inside right Johnston. Irishman Graham and McElroy send him tumbling to the ground. And yes, a free kick. Jimmy Davidson breaks through the barrier, and Scotland are one up. Three minutes later, Bingham gets it, and there's the equaliser. A beautiful bit of work by Bingham, who had snapped up a throw by the Scots goalie. Scotland are off again, keeping the ball down on the carpet. Then centre-forward Buckley takes over and beats McCavener. But an Irishman's there. Now Danny Blanchflower, number four, takes up the running, showing some of the class that puts him in the £40,000 transfer bracket. Fellow halfback Peacock joins him in the raid. Bingham shoots, Fraser parries it, but McAdams puts it into the empty net. 2-1 to Ireland. Half-time comes and goes, and Scotland, with only 18 minutes play left, are desperate for the equaliser. An injury to Danny Blanchflower has caused reorganisation in the Irish ranks, and their defence is in trouble. Bobby Johnston takes a slam, and it's deflected into the net. Scotland 2, Ireland 2. And that's the final score to the Jubilee match. A pretty fair result, and certainly a tactful one.